Hey guys, welcome back to SolidWorks and NCS Tutor YouTube channel. Before starting the video, if you are new and haven't subscribed our channel, press the subscribe button. So in this tutorial, we are going to learn that how we can convert any image into sketch and then into 3D in SolidWorks. So let's start. So first of all, I am going to download this Ferrari logo from here, which is in black and white. Once downloaded, just go to this website. I will provide the link here. And now just choose the file from here and convert it into .svg file. You can see here JPG to SVG converter. So I will convert this file like this. And now just download this SVG file where you want okay so now our next step is to install inkscape this is the inkscape software you can download it from anywhere so in the inkscape we will just import that svg file select okay from here and now just drag it. you can adjust the size from here just like length width from here and after that just go to file select save as from here okay so now we are going to save this as a dxf from here you can see desktop cutting plotter d dot dxf format just save this file in dxf format okay so from here you can select the units for your image and select okay okay so now we will go into solidworks Okay, so now in SOLIDWORKS, just select the top plane, go to insert and select DXF file. So from here you can see this is the DXF file we have generated from the Inkscape software. Just open this file, go to next, select this 2D sketch, go to next. And you can see here we have the sketch of the uh, file we have generated. Now from white background you can see this sketch. Okay, so from here you can import it as a millimeters. Go to next and select finish. Now the file, DXF file is importing in the software. So now you can see how precisely that Inkscape software has converted our image into .dxf format. Okay, so now if you want to edit this sketch, go to make edit sketch. Okay. From here, you can remove the entities or you can add some other dimensions to your sketch. Go to exit. Okay, so now we will go into the extrude command and we will select this sketch. Okay, so this is the option from where you can select the different contours or regions like this. Or you can also select it one by one to convert it into 3D. You can see our sketch is precise and closed like this. Okay. So now just click OK from here. And you can see how easily we have converted that sketch into 3D. So thank you for watching. Stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe our channel.